Egyptians weren't the only ones who built pyramids, obviously. Ancient people all over the world made their own versions of pyramids, and they were usually built to correspond with astronomical phenomena. Why did all these societies separated by oceans and millennia decide to build these structures, and how did they build them? That's an interesting question, and one that has never been sufficiently answered. Graham Hancock's answer is that the survivors of a lost Ice Age civilization went around the world passing down the knowledge of how to build these pyramids, along with teaching agriculture and architecture and art, etc., and that's how they figured out how to do it. Now, why did these survivors do this, and how did they survive the apocalypse that wiped out their civilization? And why isn't there any actual material evidence of this advanced civilization that supposedly existed 12,000 years ago? Hancock says that it was wiped out in a cataclysm, but he also says that there were enough survivors to support this global campaign to civilize the entire world, which means that there were a lot of survivors. Why didn't they leave behind any direct evidence of their existence? These questions, and many more, are not answered by Graham Hancock.